this old custom room is still alive what we are talking about we are talking about bootleggers os if you are in android community from a long time you might already know about this custom room this is bootleggers and the version 7.0 is also here i tried this custom room based on android 13 unfortunately it's not officially available for many devices although even not unofficially but i found this custom room available for realme c3 poco f3 mi 11x redmi k40 and two or three more devices so yes is it still worthy to try it out i will try to find out some things in this video the customizations and everything stay tuned this is the quick settings panel which we have which is not in the dark one which we have in the light mode basically if, even if you use light mode you will see the light quick settings panel but if you use a dark mode you will see the dark quick settings panel this is one of the things which is available in bootleggers latest custom room as i just mentioned it's not officially available for much devices so things might be different in your case if i move on to the default launcher we have the shishu launcher kind of things of course icons home screen app address, same kind of customizations in almost every device every custom room here comes some of the default wallpapers which are included these wallpapers are already pre-installed so if you like any one of this wallpaper you can simply apply this without having any issues and this works without internet connection you have a lot of wallpapers options available for example let me just try to apply this wallpaper in my home screen and lock screen both so if I try to apply this thing, setting wallpaper, and it is, this is how the UI is looking like. They have their own wallpaper collection, and I'm using this thing from a long time. Not talking about this custom, but I had tried bootleggers OS in previous times around five to six years ago. This is the settings UI, which is of course looking the same. The default fonts are, if you're able to notice, default fonts are kind of different. Which is, these fonts are actually not available in any other custom room by default. We have some gesture navigation options available, where you have the option to use the full screen gestures, but you can't, you will not be able to hide the IME space below the keyboard. But of course, it's available in only a few of the custom room. Not every custom room provides you that feature. Else, one-handed mode, as expectedly, is already present. So if you're one of the users who wants to use one-handed mode on a device, this custom room brings you that. Adaptive playback option is also included. If you use this thing, then this feature is also present here for you, where you can adjust the timeout of this adaptive playback. I don't use this much, to be honest. Swipe to screenshot is one of the most used features in Android, and this is already present, which is working fine here. If I move on to the security settings, if you're not able to see fingerprint unlock, don't worry, my device does not have fingerprint sensor, so that is why it's not showing. But right now, we have face lock, we have fingerprints, that's good but the default app lock is not present so if you need app lock you need to use any third party app for that here comes the customization part because we are talking about a custom room so this is a thing for customization some customizations related to interface miscellaneous tweaks etc etc customizations are present by the way no no unique customization is present almost same customizations are available but one major thing is that this custom room is quite old and it is still updating which is a big advantage so if you are one of the users in android community from past five to six years if you have ever used bootleggers os and you just want to give it a try you can this custom still brings you a lot of customizations by the way if i move on to some notification customizations you have the option for retigger which is right now a very new looking notification customizations we have the option related in call vibration ignore dnd we have other options related like four stop and heads up less annoying blah 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 a lot of customizations are present here which are quite handy if i move on to the lock screen customizations you have the option to customize the lock screen clock fonts some customizations customizations are also available in other devices other custom rooms but of course a lot of custom rooms right now are cherry picking custom rooms so the things might be same in your case and in my case too app related tweaks also having the option for per app volume control which is of course available in almost every custom room so far and if i move on to the system features some icon pack customizations are present some icon shape customizations are present 
Right now, if you're able to notice this UI style customizations, UI style theming options, don't be confused. Yes, these options are present in some other custom homes too, but they also cherry pick from Bootlegger's OS right now. As far as I know, this is originally from Bootlegger's custom home, but Cherish OS and some, some more custom homes are bringing the, those features by cherry picking and some other customizations are just basically same. These were things. Thanks for watching and goodbye.